Hello all, my name is Sheikh Naib. Today we are going to see Mongo, MongoDB dump and MongoDB restore commands. Friends, why do we require these two commands? The main purpose of these two commands are uh, if you want to take a backup from the production or somewhere else, then this, uh, this MongoDB dump command will be very useful. So otherwise, what you need to do is you need to uh, copy the data one by one it will be so hard so you cannot do that so if you have bulk data so the same way mongodb restore command we can put it back once we are done with the activities whatever we want to do so this is the other be biggest benefit of having the mongodb dump command and mongodb restore commands so let us explore that so what i will do is i will show you practically how those two commands works so I have my mongodb up and running so um, what I will do is I will create some data for you so what I am doing is I am going to create a uh, db called customers and hyphen db and then um, I will be taking backups all the stuff so for that I am using uh, robot 3 t so you can use this uh, uh, mongo shell command also like go to the bin directory where your mongodb is installed there also you can execute these commands so we'll be using both let's see now first what i will do is i will create a database inside my node so what i'm doing customers hyphen db is one of the database <clears throat> So, um, so here inside this, I'm going to create a collection called customers. So collection got created. So I'm opening the terminal, double click on it. So there are no records now. So for saving the time, I have already uh, written C. I wanted to create some 10 records inside that. So I don't want to type one by one all the stuff. I have what I have written is I have written a for loop. So this for loop inside this for loop I am creating ten records, ten documents, ten insert queries. So um, let me execute this. By that it will create ten documents. So documents are created. Even if you want, you can check it. Double click it now. Earlier it was zero records, right? So now it will show some records. <clears throat> so this is done now let us go to taking the backup so for that what i have done is i have created a folder where inside my e drive so i have a I have a folder called backup inside this backup folder i'm going to take the backup okay so we have to create it now so i'm going to the uh, command so this is the command so mongo mongo dump and then we should give hyphen hyphen out and then the path where you wanted to put that backup so let me copy this go to the bin directory of your mongodb where it is installed and then paste it here enter so if you see here uh, inside my backup now it, it has created the backup for both the uh, dbs one is admin db and then customers db so i will remove this and then what I will do is I will try to give instead of O out I will give short form only hyphen O let me try whether this works or not so it worked so um, I just deleted right now it generated the so either you can use hyphen hyphen out or only hyphen o so what this uh, mongo dump if you don't give anything 
plain mongo dump command and then the output directory it will take all the dbs back up into your machine so uh, for example if see here in this case my um, um, my no, MongoDB node also running in local, that's the reason I have not given um, any host. If it is running in some other place like in a VM or something, what you need to do is you need to give here hyphen hyphen host and then give the host name. So like this, then it should work and then the port, all the stuff. So once you are done, um, do like that, then it will uh, take the uh, backup. So uh, this will take all the backups, all the DBs backup. So let's say you have a requirement. I don't want all the DBs backup. I wanted to take only one of the DB as a backup. So what I will do, I will delete this. So for that, what you need to do is MongoDB hyphen hyphen DB. So this is the extra thing and the DB name. MongoDB hyphen hyphen DB is the constant the db name which you wanted to take the backup and the output directory where you wanted to put so let us see now if you see here in our backup directory there is nothing so let me take this command and then put it back so this will take backup for only customers db so it has taken only backup for customers db this is how we can take uh, mongo dumps and next is how to restore the dump now let's say i have a um, this one right mongo uh, dump i have taken i will drop this um, database so as of now in my node there is no database called customers hyphen db now i have a backup so i wanted to put back so this is the restore command so this restore command, what I'll do, I'll execute. So go to the again bin folder. So here you type the Mongo restore. So Mongo restore. So what we have given Mongo deep Mongo restore and then the path. So we don't need to give hyphen hyphen out and all here. It has because it's input. So what this Mongo restore will do is whatever is there inside this backup folder how many our dbs are there all those things it will <clears throat> restore it so uh, just before that we have um, re removed the customer siphon db right now if you see there is nothing i'll refresh it so customer db is there and then i'll go to the customers see all my records are there hey we got the output ding chick ding chick ding chick ding so when I see the outputs, I will be very happy. So this is one part of it. And then uh, let's say if you wanted to um, uh, restore only some particular collection. Um, so for that, what I will do is I will delete my um, DB backup. So here I will, I'm going to create one more collection orders so here also i will put some records for saving the time i have written a query to put the records so this will just create some records so this has now in my database i have two uh, collections and two datas right um, now what i will do is <clears throat> i will take the backup for both of them so this will take backup for entire thing right so so yeah if you see my backup there is nothing now i will take this backup command so this will take the dump dump has been taken so what i will do i will go and drop this database so now i have a requirement only to take the customer db um, customer db backup and inside customer db also only i need the customers collection if you have something else also so now as of now we have two collections right one is customers collection and then the orders collection i don't want to take the backup of order so if you have such kind of requirement see even in our backup it is their orders.vsn and then customers.vsn so we don't want the um, 
and the orders that we have sent then in this case we can specify so this is the db and this is the collection you have to take you have to restore it so what i will do i will copy this command and then go to bin directory paste it very good so if you see here now it has been restored so we'll refresh customer db has come we'll see only customers is there there is no orders so if you open this all my records are nine records are there <clears throat> friends um, i hope these two commands will help will be helpful for you uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe thank you